Okay, so welcome back to Phonics. Um, okay, so Wanda's here today because she's missing everyone. Hasn't seen you all for ages, have you? No. Um, what have you been up to, Wanda? Hmm? Just sleeping. What was that the whole time? Yeah, just sleeping. Okay. Um, okay, so we're going to carry on our learning of these sounds. Okay, so can you just tell Wanda what was this sound that we learnt yesterday? The U sound, good. And the other day we learnt this sound. U sound as well, I know, crazy. Different ways to write the U sound. Yeah, totally crazy. Um, now today, we're going back to this sound. And we're gonna read it not as the U sound anymore, no wonder, but as the O sound. So, make your lips into an O. And we're gonna do this. Okay, so we're going to be looking at cool blue. So do you notice when you say cool, o, blue, little o. Okay, so oo sounds today. Yeah, oo sounds. Okay, so let's do some really speedy reading to see if you can read these words super speedy. Okay, this word is k -u. a clue. Yeah, a clue. B Hat is blue, it's true. And the last one is g -u glue, glue. Good. Okay, so now it's your turn. Okay, so see if you can have a go. I'm only going to give you 20 seconds to write these words, okay? There's four words. Ready? On your marks. What? 20 seconds isn't long enough. Yeah, loads of time. Okay, ready? On your marks, get set. Go. The first word is blue. Have a go at writing blue. The next word is true. The next word is glue. And the last word is clue. Okay. Five, four, three. Okay, let's go through it together. So, the first word, blue. B, l, u. We don't normally, in English, have um, an o, o at the end of a word. It just wouldn't look right, would it? If that was b, l, u. If we had another sound at the end, end like a m, like bloom, then it would be a o, o. But if it's a, the u sound at the end of a word, it's going to be an a, uh, a uh, or an e w. Okay, the oo sound. So b l o. Good. True. T r o. Written as an a uh, and an a. Uh. The la next word was glue. G l o. Written as a u and an e. Fab. And the last word was clue. K l o. And it's a curly cut. We don't normally start words in English uh, with a kicking cut unless it's a silent K. Okay, well done. Okay, so your turn to write a sentence today. Um, Wanda had a go at writing a sentence, but he didn't really understand. Um, and he said to me, I didn't have a clue that's what he said didn't you he just didn't he didn't have a clue how to do it but then I did show you didn't I and then we did it together oh it's okay you don't go, don't go in Paris it's fine so we did it together um so I thought maybe you could write one sentence which was he didn't have a clue he didn't have a clue Okay, have a go at writing, he didn't have a clue. Um, the word didn't is a contraction because it's two words, did not, put together. The, the O in not gets squeezed down into a little apostrophe in the air. Okay, so he didn't, he didn't have a he did not okay let's go for it together okay ready so capital H 
H. Tricky word, he. Git. Okay, do you see what I mean here? So we've got the word did, we know how to write that, but did, didn't is did not. And there's did and there's the not. But the little O in not, it's been squeeze, 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 squeeze. And it's just become a little apostrophe at the end. So didn't have, has. When we've got a V, we always have an E. So have, he didn't have a clue. And there's our oo digraph at the end here. If you wrote it like mine, give yourself the biggest smiley face ever. And if it, you didn't, don't worry, but maybe have a little practice. He didn't have a clue. You might want to make your sentence even longer. He didn't have a clue. He didn't have a clue how to write a sentence. Wonder didn't have a clue. But now he's happy again, so he's absolutely fine. Now we've learnt how to do it. Okay, well done everybody. See you tomorrow.